Don't judge me. What's up, everyone, and all the anime fans out there? Welcome to a new episode of Don't Judge Me. Today, I'm going to be talking about Rumbling Hearts, which was a 14 episode anime about a very serious matter. You have four friends in high school Takayuki, Haruka, Mitsuki, and Shinji. And they have a very close friendship. Eventually, Haruka and Takayuki have develop a relationship with each other but then Haruka gets into an accident that ends her in a coma and she wakes up but it's three years later and a lot of things have changed but because she has amnesia she doesn't remember what happened so she thinks that she and Takayuki are still together when she when he Takayuki is actually going out with Mitsuki now and they can't reveal anything to her because it might send her body into shock which is where the conflict of the story happens. Oh jeez, this anime had me asking so many questions. It was so sad. I just found it so awful how you had friends who are so close, but then something this drastic happens and then three years pass and time stops for no one, even if it's not your fault. And just having to deal with something like that, like how do you deal with that? And, I was, and as I was finding clips of the anime, I found myself crying because I realized like how serious and how horrible something like that can change someone. I didn't really have a favorite character as I was more focused on how the story will play out. Just like, what's gonna happen? What's going down? I'm so worried, I'm so scared, uh, don't fall apart. So I couldn't really focus on having a favorite character. I also wouldn't want to be transported into this dimension because the story is just, it just makes me really sad and the drama, it's just, uh, this is a very good example of how communication is key. Of course, the circumstances are not the best. You want to be careful because you don't want to hurt the person anymore, but still you got to communicate. Otherwise it'll just destroy everything, which caused this in between these four friends in the first place after Haruka ended up in a coma. Either way, I would recommend this anime to anyone who's into romance, drama, the thing slice of life, and mostly focuses on how time changes a person, how it affects everyone around you, especially your loved ones. If you're into something like that, then this is the anime for you. I'd say the ending is bittersweet, but it's necessary because when time goes on, you eventually have to move on too, even if you don't have the same friends you did when you were in high school. It's just, oh my gosh, it's so sad. Well, that's the end of this video, dear audience. Please make sure to comment and subscribe, and I hope I won't spend the whole day crying about this. Um, next week, I'm gonna start the. I'm gonna start with a much more uplifting anime, so look forward to it. Okay, bye, peace.